What's up everyone? Today I have an unboxing of the Xbox One Halo 5 controller. I would do a review, but there's nothing really special about this one besides the paint job. So, let's get right into it. It's got the headphone jack, just like all the new Xbox One controllers do. It does come with the AA, ba the AA battery pack, so there's no rechargeable battery pack that you'll have to buy after. It's got a really nice box. I mean, I hope it's not one of these products where they put a lot of money into the box and you don't get really much with the actual product itself. And then here's the side of it, and then it just comes with a couple of packs that you can get if you actually have the game Halo. So let's open it up. Alright, so once you open it up, let's pull this. Alright, just a white cover. I don't know why that's there, but okay. And then a very, very, very nice presentation. A gorgeous looking remote. That very nice electric looking blue. The uh, buttons are all gray with the color coding on the top. Take that out. See what else we got here. Just some AA batteries. Duracell. At least they're not going cheap and giving you like Walmart ones. Let's see if there's anything else in there. Uh, some booklets. Let's see. Anything else? Oh, there goes the box. Uh, quick setup guide, obviously your warranty guide that you get with everything. What's this? And then here's the actual uh, REQ that you would get. This is the extra pack that you would get. I'm not going to show you guys the back side because it has the uh, code on it, but this would be the extra. This would be the extra pack. All right, now that we have it out of the box itself, let's take a better look at it. It's got a very nice, very very nice gray look to it with the uh, very visible electric blue tints. The buttons are not chrome but not dull gray. I don't really know how to explain it. It's a very cool effect to it. Obviously you have your USB port and you have your sync. This is what you would use to sync it up to your Xbox. The back just your regular no different look. Uh, on the bottom you have your the port for the Xbox adapter and then also the 3.5 millimeter jack that all the brand new Xbox One controllers come with. And I have the regular Xbox One controller here with me. I'm gonna do a side by side with it. So this is the regular this is the regular one that you would get with your Xbox One or that you would buy after. It's a just just a basic black, nothing really special about it. The feel of it is nice, but nothing special. And then this is the this is the brand new one. Well, this is the Halo edition one. So you can see they have they put quite a bit of a quite a bit of detail into this. And there's also a different Halo version, but that other one is the Halo Master Chief one, and I believe this is the Halo Spartan. But I like this because I like the electric blue. The other one has more copper tints on it. So here's the regular one again. Now, like I said before, performance-wise, you're not going to get anything different between the Halo version and the regular Xbox version. You are going to get a nicer look to it. You're going to get, maybe depending on what you buy, a couple extra things in-game. But other than the look, nothing really is different. They are more expensive though, that is for sure. They're, they can be much more expensive depending on what you buy. If you really want to make your look better, like if you have a different color scheme you're going for, for your setup or whatever it may be, I would rather go with the special edition. Well, that's just about it for this video. Thank you, everybody, for watching. Please leave a like, comment, subscribe. I'm a new channel, and I'm going to hopefully be having some new videos out. Maybe we'll see maybe some vlogs and gameplays. Not too sure. But that's about it for this controller. Like I said, it costs a couple extra dollars, but you definitely get it in the looks. Nothing really in performance, but if you have a designated feel you're going for, then I would definitely get an aftermarket controller than the regular just black version. So that's it for this time. Thank